Hey guys, ST here. So, um, yeah, I know I didn't do a video this morning because I knew today was a very big day and uh, I wanted to do a video about the big day. And then I kind of got distracted after I did said big day and now I'm home from work. But anyway, um, the big, big day is... Da, 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 da. I gotta dig around the bag. Ta-da! I got the Switch, baby! Oh yeah! I went and picked it up from GameStop. Uh, as you can see, this is the box. It's relatively small in comparison to all the other boxes out there for consoles. Oh, but man, it's 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 just just good huggable size. Um, along with the Switch, I got da 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 da, -da Zelda. Uh, Breath of the Wild. I can never remember all the different names, though, all the different games. And so you got all these images. Yep. And it's for the Switch. So I got, okay, don't want to see that. That's my, excuse me, that's my receipt. Uh, this, 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 that's where the game is supposed to go. Anyway, um, got, got a little bit of internal artwork, not a whole lot. So I got that. I've not actually played any of the game yet because, again, I've been at work all day. So, you know, I actually was behaving myself and um, stayed at work. Oh, yeah, I watched Logan last night. If you didn't watch my spoiler cast video because you don't want to be spoiled on the movie, just know that it is amazing. It's definitely rated R. It earned its R rating. Don't take kids, um, even though it's a superhero movie. Um... But it's amazing. You should definitely go see it. And you're going to get spoiled pretty soon. Um, now for the piece of resistance. I got a special carrying case for my Switch. Yes, the Switch is actually in here right now. It is. I swear to God. You unzip it. It's not the zipper. It is a hard case. You open it up. Oh, it's got this little pouch on the front, sli slightly padded. Uh, it's got a zipper in it, and you can put some stuff in there. I don't know what you'd put in there. Um, your hope for a uh, social life, I don't know. And it, it Velcro's like that. And, oh, it's a little smudgy, because, like, everyone and their uncle has been coming into my workstation to look at it today. Um, but it comes out. Oh, crap, 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 crap. All right, I'm going to put the switch down. You can look at it more in a second. Inside the case are two separate little cases that hold games. You can kind of see where the games would be. And then um, it does say Zelda on it in the middle. And then this pops open, not too easily. And it's got this little thing here, which also says Zelda on it. But um, this is for micro SD cards, which is what you use for your storage. So yeah, little micro SD cards for your little case. And you can either hold four games in here or three games in your micro SD cards. So you got that. There's two of them in there and a space for like a stylus or whatever. All right. So I'm going to put this to the side real quick because I want to show off the switch or the switch. Uh, it's upright like this. The switch as far as what I've got right here. Um, I haven't taken everything out of the box completely because I haven't gotten home to put everything up and get it all installed. And I'm like shining shining light into the camera. I'm being bad. Um, I haven't gotten everything installed yet because I just got home and I want to do this video first. But, okay, so you have your thing and this is the, the, the screen and let me see if I can turn it on for you. There, we're all unlocked and you can see Zelda is there. Um, I'm going to put it back to sleep real quick. Ba, 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 ba. Go back to sleep. Sleep mode. Okay. Sleep mode. Okay. Yes. Sleep mode. Okay. So now it's back to sleep. Um, the game goes in here. It just pulls out like that. And you kind of fold it back a little bit. And you push down the game and it pops out. Oh, Why would you wake up? No, I don't want you to wake up. Um, but yeah, that's the game. It's thicker than an SD card. It's about the same size. You know, I've heard these things taste terrible. No, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not licking my game cartridge, people. But if you really want me to, you can ask nicely and, um, i do it. But otherwise, you know, I ain't gonna do it. Um, so, yeah, the game just goes in there. Uh, it's kind of sneaky how the SD cards go in, because... 
basically this is your you know your game you carry this around you play it um if you plan on propping it up so that you can detach these things i'll show you that in a minute it's got this kickstand in the back oh, there's the kickstand you pull it out and you snap it in place and then you can prop it up but under the kickstand i don't know if you can see that that's where your sd card goes yeah right there your mini sd card goes in there for storage and uh, what's what else is here? You got your little charge port. Uh, looks like you got spaces for microphones or for headsets. No, no, that's not what that is. No, that's not what that is because they uh, they got like stuff in them. Uh, where's your headset port? Oh, there's there's the headset port right there. Okay. Um, and then you got like a vent and you got a power button. You got the volume buttons right here. All right. And then of course you get your little. You have triggers and you got your buttons and it's making all sorts of okay I'm putting you back to sleep now go to sleep and st you know what I'll just turn you off turning you off hey turn off okay it is off now because I don't want to actually turn it off so this is how you use it if you just want to use it as like a handheld console right ooh fancy if you want to prop the screen up somewhere and then hold these things separate they do detach there's little buttons on the back here you just press in and pull up and voila it pulls right out and you got like there's more buttons in there but um so you got this that's one controller side and then you pull this other one that's two controller sides and you mount this monitor somewhere and then you have your little controllers and you do your little thing doop 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 whatever ha uh, uh, I'm turning red in the sun can you see it yes and then when you want to put them back in you just slide it oh. slide it right back down until it snaps in place hi my sister is yeah, there she is. Okay, so you slide them back in place and they snap in. Um, it does come with, yeah, she's got fancy shoes. Uh, it comes with this like adapter piece that you put those two components into and it becomes like a handheld controller for when you want to play it on the TV. And this slides into, there's another piece that connects to your TV. And then when you slide it in there, it automatically projects up onto the TV. So you can use it like a regular console. Um, it also comes with a couple of dongles. Uh, each one can be its own little controller. So if you have like a multiplayer game, you can take it on the road and play multiplayer with it. And you know, you can play uh, like a like kind of like the Wii uh, remote Wiimote, where it's like punchy and movie. You can play it like that. There's just there's it, it's a very adaptable system. It's very versatile. Uh, granted, there aren't a whole lot of games available for it right now, and the Wii U games are not backwards compatible because obviously you can't stick a disc into this sucker. But um, other than that, it's only $300 in comparison to you know what all the other game systems cost, and you don't get a game with it when you first buy it, which is why I got Zelda separately. And there's currently talk about them maybe making the digital Wii U games backwards compatible with the system. So if you've already got digital Wii U games, you might have, you know, other stuff to play um, eventually down the line. They are going to have stuff like Skyrim out on it. So you can play Skyrim on your uh, Nintendo Switch. And yeah, so there, there's going to be a lot of fun stuff. Um, that's pretty much it. I wanted to talk about the Switch today, and I did, and you got a video that's almost twice as long to make up for the fact that I was late. Um, hope you enjoyed. Tune in Monday, because, of course, uh, no, or tune in Sunday for Walking Dead spoiler cast, or if you don't watch Walking Dead, you know, Monday when I do my daily update video. Until then, I stay out. Bye. God damn, it's hot in here. Ah.